had to just borrow the shirt for a minute. All right, check it out. Look at this thing. Ooh. Ooh. I'm having a new love affair. It's a new love affair. Michael, I'm having a new love affair. Again. <laughs> I know. Scary it, Gary. it happens every day. Again. Every time something new blooms, I'm like, no, that's my favorite plant. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at this, people. Look at this, people. That's Michael. He's one of our new guys hey. here. This guy is the Love funnest guy this ever. Guy. This is the he has the best smile of anybody Gary. that's ever worked here. The best smile that's ever worked here. Yeah. Oh, I, I can almost beat that. Not quite. <laughs> close. I'm close. I'll get there someday. Uh yeah. So that's Michael. He's a fun one. Um, so uh yeah, here we have uh this is another episode of Name That Plant. So uh I got a whole bunch of weird plants from this plant collector who unfortunately had to leave the state and they didn't know what to do and so they called me up and I gave them as much as I could for all these plants that they wanted to get rid of and, and I basically no one else was willing to give them anything so I saved all these plants and some of them I didn't know what they were going to do until uh you know this is what they look like just nothing and then you never know what happens uh when the blooms come out but this is so beautiful you can see the the gold in there the iridescent gold within the flower now uh, I am going, actually, I do know my buddy, does anybody, who knows Stuart Winchester? He's a legend. He was actually my professor in community college at Dabble Valley College in plant classes like in the late 80s. I know, that was like a half century ago, almost. But uh, yeah, he's kind of a legendary dude. He's still running around doing all kinds of stuff and uh, in the industry. And he, I, I, he called me right when I was marveling at this thing. And he had, of course, a palm question. <laughs> so he's working on some job. And I'm like, okay, Stu, you can't just keep calling me with these free plant questions, you know, because, uh, just because, well, actually he can, because he gave me lots of knowledge back in the day. But I did use the opportunity to utilize his knowledge and uh, said, Stu, I'm gonna send you a photo of a plant. Oh, I know what it is. So he actually sent me a photo. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, uh, I'll give you a hint. His uh, guess starts with an L for the genus and an R for the species. And let's see if anybody can guess this plant all right now. Uh, I'm guessing, I don't know, that's all I know about it. The fact that it's beautiful, blooming, and red, and gold on the inside, and the fact that it's a bulb. I'm gonna guess it's from South America. Uh, most of these flowering crazy bulbs like this are. Yeah, like, uh, you know, the different, um, a whole bunch of them actually. But we do have some of our own native bulbs. This is certainly not native. Or is this a, is it, there might be something from South America and Peru that looks like this, but I'm not entirely sure. Anyway, uh, to make a, uh, a long story longer, uh, I'm gonna plant it right here at the head of the garden. I think it's a perfect spot. I'm really glad that I didn't finish this spot quite yet because it gave me the opportunity to see what this plant looks like when it bloomed. And right now I'm gonna dig it in. And when you come down here, you're gonna be able to walk up to this plant. Remember, you're gonna have to come here in September to see this thing blooming. I'm not sure, it's probably only gonna bloom for about a month. I would, maybe not even that. But uh, Demo Garden's coming along, uh, <laughs> you know? We do a little bit and then we, we have to go off and do jobs and then we forget about it and then we come back. But it's gonna be done soon, soon, I promise. That's pretty much the story.